All right, guys. Um, so today we are going through the new stage of the Infinite Dragon Ball History event that just came out on Global. Um, I'm using a team that actually does complete both of the missions at the same time. So the missions are you have to be using three Patara units and three... I'm not sure if it's Time Traveler or Future Saga units, but either way, I'm completing both of those missions right now. Um, we're just going to hop in. Maybe I should have changed my Aider item to, like a ghost usher or something i might regret that in the future but i guess i guess we'll see um so as far as rotations go because oh this this was like the worst starting rotation we could have gotten <laughs> to be honest because the only ones that we really care about being on main rotation um are the tech trunkses everyone else it doesn't really matter i mean i guess except for agl rose because you want him to be on rotation in the beginning so that way he can get all of his defense built up and then by the time we get later in the event he will hopefully like have his full defense and not be taking too much damage. Um, and we also got Gowasu and Zamasu on this rotation as well. And Gowasu and Zamasu were one of the units where it's like, yeah, they're definitely going to be floaters. Um, but I don't know like what typing any enemies are in this uh, stage. Anything like I didn't look at anything is basically what I'm trying to say. So, I mean, if I brought way too many like physical units, oops, I guess. <laughs> Uh, we're definitely gonna leave Rose in this front slot. There must not have been too many red orbs because Trunks here uh, will not be getting any orbs at all. I mean, I guess. Hold up. If these AGL orbs, five isn't too many, but I, I guess we'll be okay. Hold. Let me check. Okay. I was just making sure I was still recording. Actually, let me go on. Uh, you know, no 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 notification mode, because I mean I don't want this video to end, which used to happen a lot more than I would like to admit where I would just get a phone call, and because I got a phone call, like, the recording would just stop. Did Rose just get a double super and finish this off? Rose, why did you do that? We need you to get hit, and you're just killing people. <sighs> okay, Trunks is transforming. Perfect. I guess Trunks being on the first rotation wasn't really that bad, now that I'm thinking about it. Ooh, this isn't great. Um, The reason it wasn't that bad, though, is because, like, even if the Trunks was in the second rotation, he wouldn't be transforming until next turn anyway. So, I guess we really didn't uh, lose any turns for him to be stacking up his defense. We just lost, like, one turn for him to be stacking up his attack. Okay, Vegito Blue. You know, I didn't really think about this, but I would really prefer if Vegito Blue didn't finish this off here. Alright, no crit counters. Actually, he might not even need him. 500,000 attack stat. Alright, if we don't get any crit counters, he might not finish. Please don't. Okay, I think this is the last counter. No crit. Perfect. Yes. Awesome. So, I, I need Trunks to stack up as much as he can early. Because by the time we get later in the event, he won't have any more time to stack up, obviously. Which was the same reason I was kind of upset that Rose finished off uh, Trunks last turn before he got hit anymore. Okay, so where are all the hits? Oh, what do I do here? Well, I guess I don't have any options. I guess this is what I'm doing here. Uh, Physical Future Gohan is good in longer form content like this. So, like, right now I think he only has, like, 20% damage reduction. But every time we see him, he's going to be getting more and more. Ow, ow. That hurt. Yeah, we really needed Rose to get hit more in that first phase. But, I mean, we might... We're not going to die here, I don't think. Because Future Gohan, he does also raise defense on Super Attack. But he doesn't get much defense from his passive, so I guess we'll see. We haven't gotten super yet, which is very scary. Because, I mean, I feel like a normal will do at least 30k. But a super would do a lot. Okay, no super. Yeah, 45. Gosh. Uh, Okay, this is good. We can do this. This will heal us up. This will give us a good amount of defense. It will do a lot of damage. Uh, they, they actually didn't give us too much defense. Um... Which is kind of scary, because that was a lot of orbs that Trunks got there. But, we should be okay here. He is taking double digits, though, because of the type advantage. And 2.9 million. Okay, that's good. Don't finish it off, though. Thank you. 3.3. Well, not 3.3. 3.03. But over 3 million here with no support. Alright, we need to start getting doubles from our Trunks, because... The enemy is hitting actually really, really hard right now, and we need Trunks to get to, like, at least 200k defense as quick as possible. Okay, he didn't get a double super, and he's getting supered. Are we gonna die? We actually might die straight up. Okay, we need Vegito Blue to finish this off here, because I think... Okay, good. 
I didn't realize how much HP they had left. We had 42,000 HP. All right, so this is actually pretty good here. So here I can put Rose in the front slot. We're going to use, huh. We're gonna use a Princess Snake here. And here Rose is going to build up a majority of his defensive passive. So that's why I think this is okay here. And we can also have Guasu and Zamasu on the back end, probably dodging at least a good amount here. Rose starting off, of course, the supers right away. That's worst case scenario. That's like 200k. Okay, it would have been without the item, but now he's up to double digits. Good. And now after he supers, I don't think he's going to be taking too much from normals. Because, I mean, there he wasn't taking anything from normals, but we did have the item active as well. So, I mean, I guess we'll see. We need doubles from Trunks, like, really bad. Please, Trunks. Because, I mean, here his defense was okay, but we have Guasso and Zamasu giving us 70% support. And he got an additional normal. Uh, my tech Trunks does have level 3 additional equipment. So, I, I mean, it would be nice if we could see some supers coming from that. Because, so far right there, it was just a normal. And, I mean, you never know if it's just from the equipment, right? But, I like to assume it was. Um, this is scary. We're going to do that. Get a little bit of healing. Only 40k. I'm not sure if we got enough to be super effective against all types there, to be honest. Okay, we're just going to start spamming items right now. Because right now, defensively, we're the worst we're going to be throughout this entire event. Because the Trunks are just going to keep stacking. Future Gohan will, like, keep building up his damage reduction. Uh, AGL Rose eventually will get his full passive. It might take him a while, but he will get it. I think he needs, like, two more hits or something. Uh... And I mean, Physical Vegito Blue, we floated him off because... Actually, I'm not really sure why we did that. I guess it was because Trunks had type advantage against the last stage, but here I wish I would have done the opposite of that. Uh, okay, 58 damage? Does he, like, greatly raise defense on Super and I forgot already? Because if so, kind of embarrassed. But, like, he didn't do any damage there. I mean, I know we do have the extra 50% defense from the Aider, but that doesn't make that much of a difference. Hmm... I'm going to put Trunks in the front slot, just because Trunks, Trunks' stack is infinite, and after this turn, if uh, Rose got, like, attacked, he wouldn't need to get attacked anymore. So because Rose's has a cap on it, I'm going to prioritize getting Trunks attacks. And if Trunks doesn't, like, crit or additional here, we actually might, no, because Rose is going to finish it off if Trunks doesn't actually, so, never mind. Okay, Trunks did get a crit, and it didn't finish, but we got the double, perfect. Okay, so this Trunks' defense should be pretty good now. Maybe about 200k. I know he is 210k this turn, but that was with the Aider still active. So, it's definitely not that good normally. Uh, this is very scary for Gowasu and Zamasu. Okay, so we're going to get this hole up. We might get a Dokkan mode here. And if we do, I definitely want to get it with this Trunks. Uh, there's no way we can get a physical up here, but I don't think we need to. Yeah, we don't. Okay. 150,000 defense, definitely not bad. I don't think we're going to one-shot this Goku, but I mean, we might one-shot this Goku. Because, I mean, this Trunks is going to be super effective against all types. His attack stat is going to be through the roof. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, got them all. Perfect. Here's attack stat. 2.91. Actually, not quite as high as I was expecting, but this still should do... It's definitely not going to one-shot. It should do about three bars, if I had to guess. Let's see. Slit them up. And... It did only two and a half, actually. So, not that great. Just please don't super Gwasu and Zamasu. And if you do, please dodge Gwasu and Zamasu. There would need to be so many bad things to happen for us to actually die here. Because Gwasu and Zamasu have a 50% chance to dodge. And also, out of all of the attacks, he would have to be super attacking them. So, it's looking like he might super attack them, though. Although, they do seal. Can we seal him? I should be paying more attention than I am, to be honest. Okay, we cannot seal him. We got the dodge, though, and he wasn't super attacking. fan freaking fantastic. So, I'm going to put Rose... No, I'm not. Not going to do that. I said I was going to do that. Not going to do that. Because, I mean, once again, as soon as Rose gets maxed out on defense, I mean, that's it. Whereas Trunks, it's like he can always get higher, you know? At least for nine, 99 turns. Man, I can't wait till the Link skill update on Global, and then also the turn counter... And all that cool stuff. 
I don't like how the passives show up on JP though, like where it's like all three of your units show up on screen at the same time. I like it better when it's just one at a time and you gotta click through them all super slowly, which it sounds like I'm not being serious, but I am. Okay, neither of them finished that off, which is actually really good here for Rose. This is gonna do damage. Yeah, 41. Alright, so now Rose is maxed out on defense, which means I don't need to prioritize him anymore. I could float him off if I wanted to, uh, which I might do for Physical Vegito Blue. Actually, I might do that here. Ooh, but there's so many Int Orbs. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm going to float him off because I would like... I mean, that's kind of a waste of those orbs, but because this stage is STR, it makes me think that the next stage might be Int, which would be really cool for Physical Vegito Blue. The reason I'm thinking that, by the way, is because uh, this stage would make you float off all your physical units, and then as soon as you float off all your physical units, you would want them on rotation again. That's what I've noticed they've been doing a bit in this stage. So, uh, let me see. Am I correct? Also, we haven't had many AGL opponents. There is an AGL opponent. Yep. <laughs> I noticed that at the last second. I was like, wait, I don't think we've had many of those. Alright, what's our defense up to with Gawasu and Zamasu? Alright, Trunks is at 270, Rose is at 200k. And Rose also greatly raises defense for one turn on Super. So, this rotation, we're absolutely fine. Uh, he said so, not surely now. Okay, 51 damage, okay. So, it seems like the beginning of this event was definitely the most difficult part, when you were still trying to stack up your defense and stuff. Um, now, one thing, I have no idea when this event is going to end. Uh, probably after Vegito Blue? Maybe after Merge Zamasu? I'm actually really not sure. Rage Trunks? I have no idea. This is just, like, me theorizing, because those are the three that it could be. There's no way, like, the last stage is going to be Rose, because that wouldn't make any sense. Yeah, my guess is those three. Okay, 146k. It did dodge, though, which is good. Uh, hmm. I don't know what to do here. Because, I mean, the ca uh, we don't care about counter damage right now. Right now, we're just kind of, like, worrying about defending. And Future Gohan, at this point, his he should have at least 40% damage reduction. He might be all the way up to his 50%. Uh, so I do trust him to tank those attacks in the back, at least a little bit. Especially if it's a super. Because if there is a super back there, he will tank it significantly better than Vegito Blue. And it actually looks like we might just finish this off here. If Vegito Blue... Actually, no. Future Gohan is just going to finish this off, even if Vegito Blue doesn't. 1.3, though. I'm actually not super sure about that. I really wish I had int future Gohan, man. K did finish it off, though. Uh, Goku Black? We're already up to... Okay, this isn't corrupted Merge Zamasu, though. That is something I should keep in mind. We did have back-to-back -back AGL phases, though, which is kind of weird. Alright, so here I'll pick up this one int orb, and then we'll give Rose those AGL orbs, and then Trunks can get actually a whole field of int orbs. I mean, it wasn't a whole field, but it was like half the field. So here, Int Trunks should tank decently well. Actually, after this, I do want to check and see if he does raise defense on Super Attack. Because I feel like he might. I don't know why. I know he raises allies' attack by like 30% for one turn. But I'm not sure if that's all that he does. Okay. We got our attack and defense lowered there, which does suck. How much is Rose going to tank here? Remember, Rose's defense is maxed out. And, okay, 41. We're fine. I was saying that we might get hit kind of hard there, to be honest. 3.1 million from Trunks. Really good. And super effective against all types. It only did, like, a bar, though. Zamasu is kind of tanky. Okay, I don't think he greatly raises defense on super attack. Because we got him a lot of orbs there. Uh, he greatly lowers enemies' defense. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what to do here. Because, I mean, we're just going to test out Kawasu and Zamasu's dodging, I think. No matter what I do here, I mess up the orbs for Physical Vegito Blue. Whatever, I just want to get some same color orbs here. Get us closer to a second Dokkan mode, which I think we will probably get. Just judging by, like, how far we into this event. Actually, we never fought a Rose Goku Black, did we? I mean, I guess we might have. I don't remember at all. I'm just kind of talking about it because it's like, 
We're already on to Merge Zamasu, which means if we didn't fight a Goku Black, we're probably not going to fight a Rose Goku Black. So after this is probably going to be Vegito Blue if I had to guess. And then after Vegito Blue, we could have Corrupted Merge Zamasu or Rage Trunks, and then whichever one we didn't have there, we would have after. That's my guess at this point. Okay, no crit counters, which is kind of sad. Now we need to get lucky with some dodges here. Look at them, attempting to do damage and stuff. We didn't get a dodge, we might have just died. If we just died because they didn't dodge, I'm actually going to be very upset. 354, and they're not dodging! Okay, we got one dodge. That is so bad. That is so rare for that to happen. For them to only get one dodge? Okay, but at this point, one orb from Trunks heals us up like 20k. I mean, I'm not going to use an item here. <laughs> that was so stupid. They got hit by two attacks in a row, and they have a 50% chance to dodge. Okay, so this is definitely going to finish off Zamasu here. We only have two items left. Huh. This is definitely a lot easier than Dragon Ball Super Broly stage already, though. I can just tell you that. Uh. Hmm. I think I'll do this, and then we'll get all these Intorbs. And then... I'm going to use an Android 8 here, just to get us the HP, uh, and I'm probably going to use my last Princess Snake just as a damage reduction item. I probably won't care about the healing too terribly much. Uh, was that the Trunks? Well, I could tell it was Trunks. I couldn't tell if that was the Int Trunks or the Tech Trunks. I was Oh, he dodges. Okay. I'm not sure if I like that. Oh, he dodges a lot. I really don't like that. And then he took a normal... I'm... I'm stressed. Okay, but at least we've already been hit by a super here. So Vegito Blue, I'm not sure if any of his counters are going to land, but he's going to get all counters here. Ooh, and he's gotten two supers. Uh, my Vegito Blue has a level 5 attack equip, and he also has a, a level 3 crit equip. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I want to check out his equips after this, because I'm, I'm not 100% sure if that's what he has. I know he doesn't have any gold equip. Because I only have one gold equip and it sucks. It's the like, it's a level one like type effective against all uh, against where you're super effective or whatever. Hold up. Oh, this one is bad. But Vegito Blue, what's your equipment looking like? Uh, yeah, level five attack, level three crit. So he's not looking the best, but he's also definitely not looking bad. We're gonna do this. Rose here is kind of scary. Rose and Gowatsu and Zamasu. Although, Rose's defense here, after he supers, it's going to be like 400k. We're fine. With Gawasu and Zamasu on, on a rotation, Rose's defense is through the roof. I didn't even check Trunks's at this point, because I know Trunks's defense is good. Okay, we got the double again. Good. So at this point, I no longer need to worry about the Trunks's. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. There's a hair on my screen, so I was, I was getting rid of it, and I accidentally swiped down the menu. Okay, Rose here. If Rose double supers, he might take double digit damage from a super attack from type disadvantage. Okay, that didn't do any damage. We did get a double super though. Super Rose. Come on, do it. Do it, coward. You won't. Okay, I'm glad Rose didn't crit. I almost said he didn't quit. Okay, Vegito Blue. Ow. Why don't they dodge? That is actually very upsetting. Um... What's, what is us looking like here? We're definitely going to do this. Hmm. We're going to get that one orb there. And then we're going to get those orbs with trunks, just so that you can get as many orbs as you can get. And then we're going to save those tech orbs for next rotation. And trunks should heal us up a really good amount next turn. And we might get a Zokon mode. Uh, it depends on if we get all the same color orbs here. How much is that going to do? Okay, 13k. Not much at all. Alright, so I'm feeling pretty good here. I really... So there's probably only two stages left, if I had to guess. We got doubles again, that's good. And Vegito Blue dodged a lot first turn. He's not dodging too much ever since then. Which I'm really okay with. He's got less than two bars left. 
Oh, we didn't get too many orbs here with Trunks, though. He's not dodging. Uh, future Gohan. He might finish this off here. 1.36. He has like a quarter of a bar left. If you don't finish this off, you're trash. Wow, he's trash. You hate to see it. He's also taking damage, which is scary. Uh, but here we are going to heal up. Actually, no, we're not. We're not going to heal up at all. Because I don't want to get the Dokkan mode here. I'm not even going to super with Vegito Blue just to... Please no Dokkan? Perfect. <laughs> like, with how little HP Vegito Blue has, it would be so sad if we got the Dokkan mode. Okay. So, if worse comes worse, I could just give the Dokkan mode to in uh, Rage Trunks again. Because he will be super effective against all types, assuming there's at least 7 orbs here. Oh. Oh, this is bad. There is seven orbs here. You know what I'm gonna do? He's at 500,000 defense. Um. Hmm. I mean, here I have to use this Princess Snake. Because this Trunks is just gonna get demolished. Okay, we're gonna use Princess Snake. And then I'm going to attempt transforming with this Trunks. If it doesn't work, I'm actually gonna soft reset. And what I mean is, like, if he doesn't change into orbs, I'm probably going to reset. Alright, please. I didn't even see who the enemy was here. I assume it was Rage Trunks, though. Okay. Please change into orbs. Yes! Okay. So, all of those, his defense should be at least okay. 414k is much better than okay. Then we can do that. What's his defense here? Alright, 133k with 30% damage reduction. We should be okay. Now, please just dodge Gawasu and Zamasu. Oh, we're getting supered right away. Oh, uh, with damage reduction, this should do nothing at all, though. Please? Alright, yeah, 90 damage. We're fine. Okay. 3, 2, 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Alright, we got super lucky with him changing into orbs there, by the way. Because he changes a, a random type. Alright, 5.8 million doke on mode. A crit here would be crazy. He's already super effective against all types, but a crit on a 5.8 million doke on mode would be insane. Now, one thing is, I'm all out of items, and I'm not sure if this is the last stage. Because we could still fight Corrupted Zamasu, which would be worst case scenario for us. This should do good damage. Yeah, 1.27. And he's taking double digits. Okay, that's good. Now, Gawasu and Zamasu are going to get lit up here. Yeah, 40,000. And they don't dodge. What else is new? Okay, but here our defense is really good. So we can just pretty much get all the same color orbs, except for with Future Gohan. And... I mean, even Future Gohan, if he gets supered, he's not going to get hit too hard because of his 50% damage reduction. So, here we should be fine. Uh, I didn't see how much HP they had left, though. Was he at, like... Alright, so we might finish this off here. If Rose gets a crit. Alright, 2.32. Come on, Rose, give us crit. He does have level 15 crit. Okay, he did. Uh, but there's no way Future Gohan finishes this off. Unless if he gets, like, double super crits. Because he's... He doesn't hit hard. He's here because he gets that 50% damage reduction. Which, he's gonna take a little bit from normals. But he wouldn't take that... Okay, nope, he got a crit. Is that it? Hey, we're done. Okay, Whew. So, that was definitely a lot easier than the Dragon Ball Super Broly stage. Now, if I am correct, we should have gotten all of the rewards there. We got 13 new missions. Uh, let me see. Accept all. We got 30 stones. We got a Kai. We got three dozen Kais. We got 5th year anniversary coins. Uh, I'm not sure how much of that was actually from those. Let me go make sure I actually got all of the missions. It should just say, yep, they're all complete. So, I mean, if you guys can make a team similar to this one, I would definitely say it's not a bad build, maybe. Like, I would say the core units are pretty good. If you want to drop this Int Rage Trunks or Gowasso and Zamasu, you probably can. Uh, but I'm not sure who you'd really put on their place, because remember, they have to be Time Travelers or Pratara. Um, I mean, I guess maybe Int or Physical Goku Black would work for both. Um... I mean, maybe Int Zamasu, the, this guy, 
don't use this guy. This guy sucks. Um, I don't know. Maybe if uh, there weren't too many int phases, this guy might not be the worst like choice. Um, but anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this video, please consider to leave a like, a comment, subscribe to the channel. My name has been Blaharu, and I will see you guys next time.